Hey yo gamers, my name is Prowl the Gamer, and today we're back in Grand Theft Auto, <laughs> Grand Theft Auto 5, episode 32. Yes, I bring back the intro, some people wanted it back, so I, I put it back. The reason why I took it out is because some people say it's kind of cringy. Maybe because the, the way how, the, the way I say it, say it. So yeah, I need to take this action figure out of there. Holy. Stay. Oh, shoot. Okay. Let's go to Devin. So. Last episode, we did some stuff for Solomon. So. Now we have to meet Devin. Or, I don't know how to say his name, so. Go! Don't even know. Mmm. What's going on? You're gonna dress up as traffic cops, and you're gonna rob two trust fund kids that I know and dislike intensely. Uh, why? We can get a good price for the vehicles in Asia. Look, complete the work, you'll all be well paid. You're late, sugar tits! Yep. So what's going on? Oh, 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 oh. you! Finally get to realize your childhood dream and dress up as a cop. Mr. Weston's research team suggests the two boys like to ride on the Sonora Freeway. Sounds manageable. Hey, you two get going. Ooh, let's go, T. Oh, I don't know if this shit is for me, homie. My life's already way the fuck out of control. All right, look. I'm a Darwinist brother, all right? Some prosper and some struggle. Now, are you out of your goddamn mind? This is your lucky break. Choose! Now, are you gonna do this, or have you simply found your level in life? I guess we'll find out. Yeah, I guess we will, homie! How come everyone says to him, homie? I mean, like, does he say in front of them, or do they just know he says that? I don't even know. So, let's go. Oh shoot, I went too fast, like seriously. Oh shoot. I need to remember to slow down. Hey, Frank. Hey, I'm nearly with these dudes, man. You guys comfortable on your end? Yeah, I guess. We look pretty ridiculous. <laughs> All right, man. Look, I'll see you soon. Yeah. We'll pick you up coming through Grapeseed. Get the drivers there and get them going at speed. <gasps> I keep... You know, the reason why I drive bad, I'm not actually a bad driver. For some reason, GTA 5, like, the story mode, I'm, I suck, like, at driving. But in GTA Online, I'm, like, kind of good in a way, but... 
but it's just I'm looking at the radar and the game and it's hard to like focus so I apologize for that I'm telling you 2.7 millimeters hey, how about we see which one of you two is for real so get in your cars and let's see if they move as fast as your mom the fool wants to race us we were just getting out of here anyway All right. oh my gosh destroyed How are we supposed to race them? They have fast cars. Like, seriously. I reach up to them. I'm gonna lose, and I'm gonna have a mission fail for that. No! What, what the frick? The car was damaged. Are you serious right now? Wow. Sucker racing. Try to crash them so they can, like, you know. Dang it. Wait, let me try to get them. Come on. Come on. Damn it. Oh, shoot. There. I'm gonna lose anyways, because I'm not gonna win, so... I'm 
kidding me? Okay, there. I have to pass this guy. I'm. I failed. Yeah. Coming up now, man. Beat in a few seconds. Got it. Whatever. Here they come. Well, I'll tell you about that later. They ain't gonna talk with us back here. We gotta get right up behind them. They're movie stars, people. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Damn it. Shouldn't have done that. Whatever. Right? Oh, okay. I was about to jump there, but I just realized there's, there's a huge gap. This song was using Satcox TV videos. I just noticed that. Good things come to those who wait. Shout out to Zach Cox TV. He does some GTA 5 backs and stuff like that. And we gotta stick with them. They gotta stop sometime. Yep, we did seriously look. Oh my gosh, that's so messed up. fast you were going? Gee, I don't know, officer. I, uh, try to keep it under the limit. Well, you and your boys look like you were drag racing from where we were sitting there, so, uh, why don't you get yourself out of the car? Come on. Come on. Officer. Officer. Is this officer. entirely necessary? Yes, it is. Get on. Come on. Fucking Hands on the car. Let's go. Come on. Get out of the fucking car! Hey! Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? Fucking car. All right, we gotta make sure. Get out of the fucking car, you pint-sized prick! You, you little shit, get the fuck out of here! Go Jeez, on! they're hurting them for real. <sighs> okay. Drive to the garage. So I'm gonna switch to Franklin, because he has that joint. Well, you talk a good game. Hey, you that lady? The intense dude's assistant, right? Assistant? This is Molly Schultz, Senior Vice President and General Counsel for Devon Weston Holdings. I need to tell Devon we got them cars. Mr. Weston will not discuss matters like this with you on the phone. I'll be your port of call for business concerns. Well, shit, me and your boss ain't gonna have any personal concerns. Bring the cars to Hayes Auto on Little Bighorn in South Los Santos. Mr. Weston and I will meet you. 
Jeez, look how far we holy there. So now I'm going super fast. Autos in South LA. I'm going to be there well ahead of you. Asshole. You want me to slow down? I'm kind of running away with it, huh? You ain't going to have that lead for much longer. The lead horse always burns out before the end. Dang it. I don't want to damage the car. That's a weird road, homie. Hey, Frank. Yeah. What did I tell you, bro? These cars. <laughs> this is an opportunity. Yeah, if you say so. You know what? Right before I met you, Just I was stop. Right cars. Race. It feels like it come full circle to me. Come on. No, I'm serious. If you hadn't got me fired from my repo job, this is exactly the kind of shit I'd be doing. So thanks, dog. After all the crap we've been through, man, you got me right back where I'll be at anyway. me to boost cars and most likely gonna be paying me a fraction of what they were it don't sound that different to be honest well, you must know who this guy is look him up he's a real deal i've seen his so if i keep stopping it's just i didn't be i can't damage this car and that the frequency ability is good for this so i switch to so he like to you What you were to me, I see your high. I think this dude can take me places. Yeah, maybe something like that. Wait, how far are they? Oh. Or is there some other thing with this guy and you? You know, it feels funky. Hey, I'm just trying to do what's best for Frank. You know, help him make the best of the chances he's given. Hey, if it's about the girl, I saw her first. Don't get too creepy, all right? She's a professional woman who's doing her job. And leave it at that. No sexual harassment in the workplace, T. Not on my watch. I'm serious. Both of you. Why would we date her? Good. Ah, I, I bet one of the, the missions for this fit mi for this um mission. Uh, I said mission to die. Like one of those tasks is to not destroy the car, so I might get a bronze, silver. Or even a gold for this mission. Ugh, stop damaging. We're almost there. Like, seriously. Stop. Stop. Gentlemen, I love you all. Oh, God, this is going to be fantastic. One kid and two old creeps. Who the fuck would have thought of it? Gentlemen, move the vehicles. Hey, give me five, five, and five. Oh, hey, chest kiss, homie. Boom. Dog, come on, man. You got the fucking paper? Absolutely. Look, you finish the job, you get the paper. But the order was for five cars. If I'm not mistaken, that's only two. Just give me the fucking money now. Oh, I'm so scared. I really, really am. But you know what? I'm a payment on completion, a work type of guy. You don't like the job? Take a fucking walk. Like, come on, man. Hold on. So what's next, man? Well, it's the Z-type. Chad Mulligan. Lay it on him, kid. Mulligan's a record producer. He's going through a messy divorce. He's hiding his valuable assets, including the car, so that makes it complicated. 
He'll clock any ground surveillance we run. All we've got to go on is that the car's in a lockup in Howick. So we just go house to house? Not quite. We have access to an LSPD helicopter. The computer on board can ID pedestrians from a chip in their driver's license. Find Mulligan and Howick, follow him to the lockup, someone on the ground collects the car. All right, so who does what? You're not needed for this job. Phillips, you're in the chopper. Clinton, you're on the ground. Yeah, I don't understand the deal between you two. Yeah, well, I don't understand the deal between you two either. But you know what? Life is just one long mystery. Bye-bye, gentlemen, and stay spiritual. Oh, and Michael, I'll be in touch about your friend, Solomon. All right, good. Hope you guys like this vid. Stay tuned for part 33. See you guys next time. Peace.